two, connective tissue. Group of tissues in the body that maintains the form of the body and its organs and provides cohesion and internal support. The connective tissue includes several types of fibrous tissues that vary only in their density and cellularity, as well as more specialized and recognizable variants. Connective tissues can be divided into three types. 1. Loose connective tissue. 2. Dense connective tissue. 3. Specialized connective tissue. 1. Loose connective tissue. Loosely arranged cells and fibers in a semi fluid substance is distributed all over the body and support tissues and organs from strain and displacement. Example Areolar tissue and adipose tissue. Areolar tissue. It is present beneath the skin, serves as a support framework for epithelium. It contains fibroblasts, macrophages and mast cells. Adipose tissue. It is located mainly beneath the skin. Cells of this tissue are specialized to store fat. The excess of nutrients converted into fats and having large storing capacity in this tissue. 2. Dense connective tissue. In this tissue, collagen fibers appear abundantly in the form of bundles and are placed regularly or regularly between the cells. It is again divided into two types. A. Dense regular connective tissue. The collagen fibers are present in rows between many parallel bundles of fibers. Example, tendons. White collagen fibers connect muscle to bone. Ligaments. Yellow elastic fibers connect bone to bone. Two bones. B. Dense irregular connective tissue. It has fibroblasts and many fibers, mostly collagen, present in the skin. 3. Specialized connective tissue. Cartilage, bones and blood are various types of specialized connective tissues. A. Cartilage. The cartilage is made up of cells, chondrocytes. The study of cartilage is chondrology. The cartilage is divided into four types based on the composition of intercellular matrix. They are hyaline, elastic, fibrous and calcified. B. Bones. Bone is a hard skeletal tissue. Study of bone tissue is called osteology. Bone is composed of cells fibers and matrix. The matrix is collagenous calcified, hard and constituted by minerals and salts such as calcium phosphate and calcium carbonate. Bones contain matrix osseine and osteocytes are present in the spaces called lacuna. Limb bones such as the long bones of the legs, serve weight-bearing functions, also interact with skeletal muscles to bring out movements. The bones take up the functions such as 1. Support to the body 2. Production of erythrocytes and white blood cells from the red bone marrow 3. Protecting vital parts such as heart and brain. 4. Giving shape to the organism. 5. Storage of fat in yellow bone marrow with the advancement of age.